Hello, this video will show you how Math Mastermind will be played online for CMOC 2020. It is a team-based challenge which consists of two rounds. Round 1 will have 20 questions and a time limit of 15 minutes. The aim of Round 1 is to collaborate, teach and learn from one another. All team members are involved and can answer each of the questions. So, help each other out and answer as many questions as fast and accurate as you can. Each right answer is worth one point and no points are deducted for wrong answers. For the Zoom, each team of nine will be put into one breakout room. You may join the breakout room once invited. In each breakout room, there will be one invigilator who will monitor the whole process of math mastermind. Each team will have to discuss and choose one person to be the leader throughout round one and round two. The leader will have to share their screen and log into the online contest system. He or she will be in charge of inputting the answers. You may share your screen as follows. Once you are able to see the toggle bar, you have successfully shared the screen. From here, use the username and password given in the online contest pass. Do remember to use the username ending with M3R1 for round 1. Log in and wait for further instructions. The invigilator will give you the go ahead to refresh the page. Enter the security key given by the invigilator and you may enter once the team is ready. Once in the contest, the countdown will start and the team may start answering the equations. The team will have to use the four surrounding numbers as well as the four equations, plus, minus, multiply and divide to form an equation equating to the middle number. For example, you may use 5 plus 1 to equate to 6, or 3 times 2 to equate to 6. Once finished, you may head to the next question. Do remember to help each other out and answer accurately and quickly. Make sure that everyone is involved. Please use a slash sign as the division sign. Please also note to use an asterisk as the multiplication sign. Once ready, you may submit your answers and log out of OCS. Here, wait for further instructions. The invigilator will inform the team once round 2 has started. The second round will have 18 questions and a time limit of 10 minutes. All questions will have the same format as in round 1. However, here, each student will be assigned to two questions to answer individually. Team members are not allowed to help each other. Backtracking of questions is not allowed as well. For example, if one member decides to skip the question, nobody else can go back to the question to help answer it. Two points will be deducted every time members are caught helping each other. The invigilators will monitor the whole process. Once the invigilator has informed the team to start on round two, the leader should start sharing his or her screen. Use the username and password given in the online contest pass. Do be sure to use the one ending with M3R2 for round 2. After logging in, wait for further instructions. When given the go-ahead, refresh the page and enter the security key given by the invigilator. 
before you enter, make sure that each member has been assigned two questions. Once the team is ready, you may enter. The timer will start counting down. Open the Zoom chat room and wait for the member's answer. Each member should only answer to their assigned question. Once the leader received the answer, he or she may copy and paste it into the online contest system. Once ready, head on to the second question and repeat the process. If the member decides to skip, do make sure that no other member go back to the question to answer it. Move on to the next member and make sure that everyone has had their turn. Once all the members have had their turn, the leader may click on the red finish button to submit. You may now log out of the online contest system and wait for further instructions. Thank you.